The Glenmarn Town line out is in goal number one Paul Carley. Full back line is number two Carl McJevins, number three Shane Carley, and number four Eugene Furlong. The half back line is number five Mark Carley, number six Willie Carley, and number seven John McCormack. In the middle of the field we have number eight Barry Kerwin, number nine Tommy Kyo. Half forward line is number ten Pierce Donahue, number eleven Gary Laffin, and number twelve PJ Carley. The full forward line comprises of number thirteen Gavin Ryan, number fourteen Ian Mickham, and number fifteen Mickey Laffin. All right, the St. Andrew Tangan team is in goal number one, Roger Carroll. Full back line is number two, Jeff Barry, number three, Donald Berry, and number four, Charlie White. The half back line comprises of number five, Kevin Bryan, number six, Darren Ryan, and number seven, Paul French. In the middle of the field is number eight, John Simpson, number nine, Rory Stafford. Half forward line is number 10, Redmond Barry. Center forward is Jack Berry, and number 12 is Dave Doc O'Connor. The full forward line is number 13, Dave Fogarty, number 14, Dermot, Mac Dermot Berry, and number 15, Francis Simpson. Toss throw in now, Willie Carley's up with Dermot Berry. With referee Nicholas Kyo from Club On. And his pet is senior Ireland quarter final. Can't do the same thing. Alright, we're just waiting now. So Willie Kyo, game is on. The Barnhill are playing against whatever win is out there. John Simpson hits the ball into the way forward. Jevons misses it. Out to Doc O'Connor. Doc O'Connor shouts. And straight over the bar. Dave O'Connor with the in. Foot forward on Shane Carley. Also number 16, Rich Doyle, seems to be playing. Going forward on John O'Connor. Paul Carley pokes out the top of the wing. Donald Jevons comes out towards Beats his man. Comes out to Tommy Kyo. Tommy Kyo goes on a bit of a solo run. Beats Jack Berry. Puts it in. But no, Darren picks it up. Puts the ball back out towards Jack Berry. Mark Carley comes out, pulls on the first time. Up to me. Yet again, Darren gets the ball. And it's a free in. A free in for the Ants. On their own. About 70 on their own. 60 yards. No 60 yards. Darling puts the ball in low in front of Francis Simpson. Who's marking Eugene for long? Eugene comes out in this time. Drives it 45 yards towards Barry Carmen. Barry Carmen misses, misses the ball. Mark Hardy puts on the first time. Good ball. Comes back out to number Rory Stafford. Rory Stafford puts it in. Willie Carley. Willie Carley comes out. No, he misses, drops the ball. Number seven, Paul French has it. Number five. Picks it up. Goes down on the ground. Comes out to Pierce Dunahoo. Ball, bad ball to Pierce. With the gloves up, that's Dyer Rain. Dyer Rain puts the ball into the corner, into the corner forward position on top of Francis Simpson. Who's in four long picks it out. Eugene drives it up the wing towards Barry Carman. Barry Carman misses it and goes over the line for the line ball for the hands. One point and all score in favour of St. Arnes. Tommy Kyo drops back. Also PJ Carley's been in the corner forward and Mickey Lappin's been moving that wing forward. Tommy Kyo goes to the ball and misses it. Yeah, very good block by Eugene Farron comes out to Dr. Connor. Takes a few steps out to the wing. And pass it to Francis Simpson. This block down. Come on, Jeffrey's pulls on it. Doc O'Connor gets the ball again. It's in front of Shane Carley. And passes out to number 14, Dermot Berry. But intercepted by Willie Carley. And a free out and pulled back there on Willie Carley by number 14, Dermot Berry. Ball chops Carley now. Players take out this free. Dermot Berry has got going. Oh, 
on this game. Come on, Jerry drops on the 45 down, 45 and Poppy Gary left him down. Gary's back down, Poppy tops Gary. And there's a wave. There's a good wall. Poppy Gary left him with Darlene coming out on top. Tops, there's the ball, there was again. And drives it on top of Mickey Nuffin's side. Drops on the hands, 65. Breaks. Two men, Tiggy Martin and one first. Both around. John McCormick comes out. Tommy Kyle picks the ball. Puts it into the Ian Wickham, the full forward. Kizak Carly picks it up. Drives it. Puts it over the bar. A point for Kizak Carly. For moving at the corner forward. Hope to say about him. The goalkeeper was a parry. That might settle the game now. There is no bit. It's going to be a tough, a tough hour of Harland. But then we'll have a parry box it out. And in the 65 moment, Mark Harley. Neil Jean is over the ball. And it will be a uh, try, I'll we'll say. To Mark Carley and John Simpson. And Barry Carroll and John Simpson. And John Simpson comes out. They're poking around there. So looked out. Barry Carroll gets a hand pass to Kenny Call. Kenny Call delivers it. Top of Dermot Berry. Dermot Berry makes it for the back. Hooks it again. Top of Barry Carroll. Harry Garron puts down on top of Mickey Laffin. Mickey Laffin manages to get out for us, Tommy Kyo. Tommy Kyo on the N65. Good plays. And foul for John Simpson. Gary Laffin is getting a free taker now. About 50 yards out from the Anne's goal. Now the wind is kind of against him. Gary puts it in the mall. Scooped out. And it's going out wide. Wide ball, the umpire says, but Mickey Kyo is going in to uh, consult with him. And it looks especially bad free from Gary. Oh, is the referee on? Wide ball it is. Power to put the spot out. <laughs> Such as means now. Tommy John McCormack and Tommy Tommy Claw. Oh, he's got the ball. Puts it twice. Puts it in on top of the full forward line. Puts it away. So it also went to Paul Carley's face. The ball out again on top of the towards Mickey Laffin. Mickey Laffin will be marked with Kevin Byrne. Gary Laffin. Dar Ryan has the ball. Hooks up the wing. On top of Thomas Jevons. Thomas Jevons being held. And number 14, Denver Perry. Thomas Thomas has it. And she's probably good still as far as Tommy Kyo. Tommy Kyo puts in a low ball into Mickey Laffin. Mickey Laffin misses it. Two of them in. Get on top of each other. Gavin Ryan. He's in, giving a hand. And this is it. And number five. Kevin Bourne kicks it into our Doc O'Connor. Looking for Long Gesso. Trying to bury his way out with hands. Comes out to Tommy Kyo. Tommy Kyo pokes the ball along the wing on top of Mickey Laffin. Mickey Laffin goes on the ball, goes blocked. Pulls again out the wing towards Gary Laffin. Gary Laffin being well marshaled by Dara Ryan. Dara Ryan scoops. This in a tackle. Dara Ryan. Dara Ryan is 
very well for the Lions. The Lions go into a two point to one lead. Oh, it's just kind of the same one doing. First time he gets the ball back to Mark Harry. Mark Harry gets blocked down. Mark Harry gets the ball again. Picks it. Puts it up to wing. On top towards Gavin Ryan. Gavin Ryan missed the ball. It's going to be a lane ball for the Irons. Number seven, Paul French now is going to take this lane ball. Ball is going to Mark Harley. Mark Harley misses the ball. Put on the first time out to Shane Carley. And Shane Carley misses it, falls over. But gets it. Gets it up again. Gets it up the second time. Loses the hurt again. Tommy Kyle puts the ball in top of Ian Wickham. No one there for the break though. And out to Mickey Laffin. Picked up by Barry. Owen Barry delivers it back in towards the, the Ansford foul line. Picked up by number 14, Dermot Barry. Dermot Ham passes out to number 16, Rich Doyle. Rich Doyle out to num goes out to number 15, Francis Simpson. Shane Carley comes out, Ham passes out to Tommy Claw. Tommy Claw. Very blocked there by number 9, Norris. That ball started to go and puts it back in top of it. Conor Jevons now will be marked by Francis Simpson. Number 14, Dermot Berry has the ball heading for the goal. Dermot Berry. And it's brought down. 21 yards free for the Irons. It's gone this first half. They have a hundred first take the free. What will you do? Drives away. Drives away. 21 yards to drive the ball away. Maybe that could be a sign of things to come. Please, God. Hooks the ball out down the wing and top of Mickey Lappin. Picks up the break, puts it into the full forward, Ian Wickham. Breaks out to Gavin Ryan, Gavin Ryan doesn't get it. Number three, Donald Berry has the ball. Puts out the wing, but it's half blocked. Out to French, Paul French. But Paul comes out to Gary Laffin. Gary Laffin puts the ball in and across to Mickey Laffin. Mickey Laffin drives the ball away. Thank you. 
Gets the ball. Going through. 
gets fouled. Yes, foul on Mark Harley. And number 15, Francis Simpson. There's Carly's man. There's Donald Hood's man. Honor of Father. Looks like he just hit it. Puts it wide. That's another. That's two for Ethan Gary and two none nowhere. All these fees will be fighting. So he's a hard man. I'm being forward over seven and a half inch. He's making this in the forward. He's making a lot of this in the forward. He's making a lot of this in the forward. He's making a lot of this Comes out to Barry Herman. Barry Herman picks the ball, drives it into Mickey Laughlin. Mickey Laughlin gets beat to the ball, but on his head, Mark Simpson has it. Jerry. Three outs. Barry's barging. Number 14, Jerry Berry. Ball tied. Just. So he's on the party for a guy now. Puts it on top of Gavin Ryan, Gary Lassen. Gavin Ryan gets the ball. Gavin Ryan to his son of the ball. And puts it on the line. Two points from Gavin Ryan. Four points from Gavin Ryan. Four points to St. Anne's. Twelve minutes left in this first half. This might be a ding-dong battle on the field. I'm good for the hearts of me, my team, my own supporters. Patrick Hart looks there again on top of Barry Curran and John Simpson. Barry Curran makes it towards the pulls on. That comes out to John McCormack. John McCormack is beaten to us. Gets to the second lane. John McCormack just hit, puts it in, top of Pierce Donahoe. Pierce Donahoe and Gary Laffin chase it for the one ball. Pierce gets the ball. Puts it out to Gary Laffin. The Gary Laffin being put by Barry. Here's the one who's fouled again. Good more for him. The ball's not too clear. The Gary's being put by number 11, Jack Barry. Jack Barry moves out to the wing. Puts it in low one to the forward again. Shane Carley. Willie Carley gets the ball. Hand passes it out to Mark Carley. Mark Hardy pulls on it, and it comes out to Barry Carman. Barry Carman has time. Oh, it's smothered really quickly with Ribbon Barry. Barry Carman puts it up to, up to the wing forward position. PJ. PJ has it, but now it comes out to John Simpson. John Simpson puts the ball in. On top of Shane Carly. Francis Simpson picks up the ball now. Looking dangerous. Here's the forward against the ball. He gets fouled. If we bring the ball forward, ten yards. Out now, Francis Simpson. Paul Carey takes this free now. Just outside zone front, twenty-one yard line. This might be a big one. Goes in. Drops in on the 21-yard line. Gary Laffin is beaten to it. Ian Wickham pulls on it. Ian Wickham is foul. Ball comes out to Peter Carley. Peter Carley hits a low buzz block. Nine fouls. Peter Carley gives away a free. on Mahina Glenburn on 45 and 21. Willie Carley claims it. Being dragged out by number 11. Different passes. It's going to be a throw in. Nicholas Carley. Willie Carley, number 11, Jack Berry. Oh, Willie Carley wins it. Barry Carman pulls on again. There's Donahue. Here. Carly gets the ball and it's all in the middle of the wing. 
Mine's the lane falling. It in by ball with John McConnell. You make him get it. You make him hand pass it out to Willie Carey. Willie Carey slides it about 65 yards out, drives it, but puts it away. Do a bit of play there, don't forget that now. Throwing the ball around nicely. And goes out for a lane ball. For Jim Brown Jr. Four points apiece. Very low score in the first half. Tony Gill will take a bit in his own 65 yard line. Kevin Bourne who puts it back into the front corner line. That'd be Eugene Furlong. Mark Harley has the ball. Eugene Furlong has the ball. Playing well there. Gets a free out. Passes out to number nine, Laurie Stafford. Laurie Stafford puts it in a high ball. 